Hi there, I'm here to talk about some really great original artwork, watercolor paintings that show the evolution of the Dallas Stars uniform from when they were in Minnesota right on up. There's all sorts of artwork we're going to show you in, in just a moment, right on up to the, the, the Stars' latest uniforms. Um, uh, this is original artwork that's being offered for sale that would make a great gift you have Father's Day, Mother's Day, Christmas gift, birthday gift, anniversary gift, retirement gift, or it doesn't even need to be a gift. Somebody could just be a great Dallas Stars fan and they love artwork, and this artwork would really look beautiful in, in somebody's home or in their office. Let me give you a little background and then we'll get into the art. Uh, my name is Scott Silcox and I'm from Toronto. Uh, for 16 years I owned a company called Maple Leaf Productions. And maybe you know us Canadians, we use the word maple leaf on anything we do. Um, and we made and sold a whole variety of products that celebrated the history of not only NHL uniforms, but, but NFL uniforms, Major League Baseball uniforms, quite a number of college football teams, and, and even CFL uniforms. But I won't bore you to tears about what the CFL is. But what we did is we used this great artwork. Um, um, and again, I'll be showing you this in, in just a moment, but we use this great artwork on a family of products. The product that we sold by far the most of was one that we called a plaque poster. And forgive me, Stars fans, that I'm showing you a Maple Leafs product, but, but you get the drift. Um, the plaque poster, what it did is it showed the evolution of a team's uniform from its early years to the uh, modern era. Um, and in addition to our large plaque poster, we used that artwork for our medium-sized poster, uh, plaque poster, and our small plaque poster. So, these images were used on plaque posters, but in addition to plaque posters, we also used the images on framed posters. Here's just a couple samples of frames. We did dozens and dozens of different shapes and sizes of frames, but here's a couple. Again, using the artwork to show an evolution of a team's uniform. So we did plaque posters and frame posters. Then still there were other products that we used the artwork uh, on. We made clocks. Here's an example of a clock. We did coffee mugs, a couple samples of coffee mugs that used the artwork. Uh, we did fridge magnets, um, again, a couple different shapes and sizes of fridge magnets. Uh, we did a little product called a fan frame that again used the artwork to honor a team's uniform evolution. We did playing cards, you know, kind of ace, king, queen, jack, ten playing cards and oh, a number of other products, uh, mouse pads, collector plates, and on it goes. What's my point? Uh, my point is that this artwork is really rather famous artwork, and I know that sounds like I'm patting myself on the back and that's not the sort of person I am, but the point that I'm trying to get across is this really is, as much as sports artwork can be famous, it really is famous sports artwork. It's been seen on tens of thousands of products sold across North America, and in addition to, to that, you'll see it in the, this artwork hanging in the offices of the team owners, of the league commissioner. You'll see them on TV ads and TV shows, on movies. Um, you'll see them on team websites, and, and you'll see them in the halls of fame. So this artwork, it really is famous sports artwork, and, and that's what we're offering for sale. And by the way, almost everything that I'm explaining in this video can be seen on our website that's devoted to the sale of this artwork, and that website is Heritage Sports Art. Dot com, and I'll tell you that a few more times. But now let's really focus on the, the Dallas Stars. We've got 15 pieces, and only 15 pieces of artwork that celebrates the evolution of the Stars uniform when, from when they started in Minnesota in the 67-68 uh, season, and, and you're know, carrying on through. And I'll just kind of flip through these somewhat quickly, but just so you'll get a sense. If you visit our website, heritagesportsart.com, you'll be able to see all of these in great close detail. You'll be able to see the artist's signature and zoom in on, on the great detail and beautiful artwork. You'll even see you know, some notes that we, we gave to the people producing this family of products to, you know, to take care. So this is really raw, original artwork. Um, wonderful stuff. Um, so now you can see now they've moved to Dallas. Um, and these are just some examples of the artwork, 15 pieces, and you know, this is the, from the Stanley Cup winning year in 98-99, um, and so on, here we go, that wonderful uh, third uniform, and, and then to the modern uh, uniform. So there's 15 pieces of art, and there are literally tens or hundreds of thousands of Stars fans. So 
as much as I sound like I'm selling a super chamois or a Ginsu knife or something here, my point is I think it's valid that, that there are tens of thousands or hundreds of thousands of Stars fans and only 15 pieces of artwork. So if you're interested, um, please act sooner rather than later. Thanks. Um, now, uh, let me describe the three ways that you can buy this art. And I'm gonna, I'll just use this um, 6768 artwork as an example. All of the pricing that I'm about to describe holds for, for everything except the one exception is that Stanley Cup winning year, the 98-99 season, where there's a little bit of a premium, a hundred dollar premium on that item. Uh, so if you'll just bear that in mind, but otherwise the pricing holds for all 15 of these pieces of art. Um, so the first way you can buy the art is in this raw, unframed format right here. Um, you would place an order, we package it properly, um, we'd ship it to you by UPS and the price of $350 includes UPS shipping. Um, and then when you receive it approximately a week later, then you could frame it or mount it however you see fit. So the first way you could buy the artwork is in this raw, unframed format, and that's $350. The second way you can buy it is in this, what we call our, our classic frame. It's a black metal frame, a double white mat. Forgive me that this is the tent for Broncos here, but pretend you see the, the, you know, the star's artwork here, the framed artwork, and then there's an engraved plate telling the story of the artwork. So this classic framed version is $425. That includes the UPS shipping right to your door. And if you placed an order today, we would actually custom frame this for you. And so it wouldn't arrive at your doorstep for about two to three weeks. Um, so just bear that in mind if, if you were placing the order. So the classic frame version is $425. And then the third and final way that, that you could purchase the artwork is in our what we call our deluxe framed version. Uh, again, this is a Bruins one, forgive me, pretend you're seeing the stars. It's a, a, a wider black frame, a black mat, the artwork, um, an engraved plate, and then the fun thing that this has is a, a horizontal poster showing the evolution of the whole team's uniform, and so you'd actually be able to see your artwork and then see how it was used in the actual poster. I think it's kind of fun to, to go from the original artwork to the, the, or to the actual product. So this deluxe framed version is $450. That includes UPS shipping again right to your door and it would be custom framed so if you placed an order it would be two to three weeks before it arrived on your doorstep. So the three ways you can buy it, unframed $350, classic framed $425, deluxe framed $450 and the one exception to the pricing is that $98.99 season when the Stars won the Stanley Cup that's $100 added to, to any of those just to, to meet supply and demand. Um, boy, you're great. I want just to briefly explain that the artist that did this artwork is a wonderful lady and a, and a terrifically talented artist, a woman by the name of Nola McConnell. Nola actually owns all of this artwork. She's asked us if we'd help her sell and you know, promote the sale of the artwork, which I'm delighted to do because of my background with Maple Leaf Productions and all the research and everything that went into this. So just to explain who actually owns the artwork. Um, now, how do you order? It's really simple. There's two ways that you can order. One is visit our website, heritagesportsart.com. It's fully e-commerce enabled. You can buy using a major credit card through the PayPal system. Or if you felt somehow uncomfortable buying online um, or had questions, my name is Scott. My cell phone number is 416-315-4736. Just call me. We could play, you could place the order with me over the phone and I'd get a chance to tell you a little bit of the history that went into this. I could tell you some stories about the artist or working with the NHL or it would just be great to talk to a Stars fan. Um, so feel free to call me, Scott, 416-315-4736. Ah, you've been great put up, putting up with me as I kind of am doing my uh, pitch here. I really do feel like I need some Ginsu knives or something to, to sell. At any rate, two quick points and then I'll leave you alone. One is if you, if you know other Stars fans who you think might be interested in this artwork, I would be very appreciative if you would share this YouTube URL with them and, and just kind of forward this URL. That would be really nice of you. And, and secondly, I mentioned at the outset that the, in addition to the Stars artwork, you know, we had done artwork for all of the NHL teams and NFL teams and Major League Baseball teams and a good number of NCAA college football teams. And in fact, our website heritagesportsart.com has 1,500, over 1,500 pieces of original art available for sale right now. Um, now, that, you know, that 
Dallas Cowboys, the Texas Rangers, the um, Houston Astros, um, you know, on and on. You know, all the NFL teams, baseball, hockey, um, college football, or quite a number of college football, it's all available on the website. So please feel free to pass that info on if you knew somebody who's a fan of another team and, and that they might like art. So thanks very much for putting up with me. You're really great. I wish the stars all the best in the upcoming season. Thank you. Bye.